Welcome to Marine Tech Hub. Today I would like to explain you some of the troubleshooting with respect to centrifugal pump because most of the junior engineers or the trainee engineers uh, they have to know the basics. So if you see the first condition uh, if the pump fails to deliver water. So in that case uh, make sure the pump is primed. Huh? That is one of the case. Then if the section lift should not exceed the design. If the lift is too much then also it will not deliver water. And if the speed is insufficient. And in case there is an air leakage then also it will not deliver water. If the impeller is broken. So broken impeller of course it is not going to push the water. If the direction of the impeller is wrong, then again you have to check the direction of the impeller will be given on the pump, there will be marking. Check the manual direction is very important. The second thing which uh, junior engineers should note is pump is not priming. Uh, priming means it should be able to full of water it should be so that then only the pump will run properly. If there is a leakage, air leakage in the system, then it's not going to prime. If you are priming it and if there is a gland leaking, then all the water goes through the gland. So in such case, you need to tighten the glands or change the gland with new one. Or if there is a leaking in the joints, casket joint if it is leaking, then also. Then priming device itself is faulty, then you have to check that. Now regarding building up of pressure, pump is running but it is not building up pressure. So in that case what you do is prime the pump, that is one case. Check if the air cock is open, if air is cock is open of the pump then again it will not going to build up the pressure. Check if the speed is too low, if the due to some reason the speed of the pump is not sufficient then also it is not going to build up pressure. If air is in the water, some air is there trapped in the water, then cavitation effect will be there. If the impeller is damaged, then also you will not be able to build up pressure. So if the wearing is owned out, then there will be short circuiting, then it is not going to build up pressure, then you have to change the wearing with the new one. Check the clearance and change. Or if there is some mechanical defects also, there will be a problem, then also it is not a build up pressure. Fourth condition is insufficient capacity. If the pump capacity is less, you want to pump more then, then in that case the total dynamic head is larger than the rated one. Then also we have problem. If the section lift is too high. The pump is designed for a particular section lift but you have to see how much it is going to lift. If the liquid temperature is too high also then also we have problem. So temperature should be normal. If the speed of the pump is less, I told you if the RPM, check the RPM. If there is obstruction in the section pipe, also then it is not going to work properly. Air leakage already we discussed, similar problem will happen. Now pump loses water after starting. So you have started the pump, then uh, pump is not, uh, water is not being pumped out. That means there is some hindrance in the section side. So section lift to check and if the temperature of the water is too high or something like that, check the fluid temperature. If there is leakage in the section line or if there is, uh, if the, there is a foot wall, the strainer is stuck and uh, filter is dirty then also you will lose the section there. If there is a vibration in the pump then you will do check the alignment then check the foundation, then imbalance impeller also will have a lot of vibration, mechanical faults like bolt broken somewhere. If the bearing is owned out, shaft or eroded impeller then have problem. If the motor is overloaded, normally motor will be overloaded, if the speed is too high, pumping water too much, viscosity of the fluid is very high or something like that. So all these defects uh, you will be able to rectify 
one of the case i would like to explain here if the pump is not taking section and uh, you are trying your best check for all these problems then if you have any doubt regarding uh, the pump not taking section then message me thank you